Hello everyone, welcome back to some more CBG and uh Alright, let's resume. He will become sin with my help. Lies. Forget them. If he becomes sin, Sir Jack will be saved. We're leaving. You know something, tell me! <sighs> tell me. Oh boy. Sins. My old man. You hit your head. Sin is my old man. My old man became sin. I don't know how or why he did it. I felt him inside. And when I did, I knew it was true. Oh boy. My old man's spirit is suffering. Sorry. Even knowing that sin is your father. Still, you know I must. Yep. I know. Let's get him. I think my old man would want that. You'd fight your own father? Yeah, no problem there. <laughs> uh, about your old man. You sure this ain't some kind of bad toxin dream or something? Then, Chapu. Sorry, dude. I, uh, I think I'll just pretend I didn't hear nothing. <laughs> I'm getting a little confused, yeah? Why, why'd all this have to happen? We'll learn when we arrive, soon. <laughs> Yeah, Xanarkin's kind of a scary place. All right, guys, I'm gonna take care of the sphere grid real quick and uh, be right back. Okay, let's uh, continue. Oh, say. Okay. Wow. <sighs> Holy Jesus. A tornado of magic. What? What are those? Those are faith. <sighs> a summoning. Someone is using these faith. Someone is drawing energy from all of them. This many? Who wields power on this scale? And what could they be calling? Hey, you know something, don't you? Spill the beans! Look not to others for knowledge. This is your journey, too. Yuni might die, you know? No. Aaron's right. Huh? This is our... This is my story. Oh, boy. What? He's covered in pyro flies. Hey, it's Sanderkin. Hey, hey. But it looks a little strange. Can I go back here? Oh, 
Nothing to look at. Hey, he's home. He finally made it home. Oh, hello. Welcome home. Yay. You remember me? We met in Bavel. Uh, yeah. But that wasn't the first time we met. I've known about you for a long time. A long, long time. I... I feel like I know you too. Where are we? <laughs> Silly, don't recognize your own home? All those Blitzball trophies. Oh, man. What's gotten into you, eh? Come on, Titus. No time to be Wait, snoozing on the job. This is a dream. Precisely. Yeah. A dream? A dream? Are, Are you, you crazy? crazy? I don't have time to be dreaming now. You're wrong. It's not that you're dreaming. You are a dream. Huh? Wait a sec. Eh? All right, spill the beans. Long ago, there was a war. Yeah, with Machina, right? Yes, a war between Xanarkand and Bavel. Bavel's Machina assured their victory from the start. Spira had never seen such power. The summoners of Xanarkand didn't stand a chance. Xanarkand was doomed to oblivion. That's why we tried to save it, if only in a memory. What did you do? The remaining summoners and the townspeople that survived the war, they all became faith, faith for the summoning. The summoning? You mean sin? No, I mean this place. A Xanarkand that never sleeps. What? The dreams of the Faith summoned the memories of the city. They summoned all the buildings, all the people who lived there. The people? What? They're all dreams? Me? Too? Yes, you're a dream of the faith. You, your father, your mother, everyone, all dreams. And if the faith stopped dreaming... <laughs> we got problems. We have problems. So what if I'm a dream? I... I like being here. We've been dreaming so long. We're tired. Uh. Would you and your father... Would you let us rest? Both you and your father have been touched by Sin. Sin, the one around whom all Spira, the Spiral, evolves. What are you saying?
You two are more than just dreams now. Wake up! Wake up, please! Just a little more, and maybe... Maybe you are the dream that will end our dreaming at last. All right, everybody, get all that. <clears throat> Pretty much, they're dreaming slash sum summoning, right? and that's how Titus came to be. Oh, hey, we were so worried about you. You okay? I, I'm okay. What happened? Nothing. I blacked out. I was dreaming. <laughs> you called me, and I woke up. Uh, uh, uh. Nothing like a good nap. Well, I'm ready. Let's go. Oh, boy. Okay, let's, uh... uh. This is a cool place, though. It's really nice. Nice mountainous. Oh, yeah. Yeah, more battles. Ugh! Another long sword. Okay. First trial of Gagazette. Um, I hit that. Okay, that time it didn't hit. Ah. Oh, that that hit. Yeah, that did. Ah. Try this. Yeah. Did I do it? <laughs> All right, cool, got it. I'm definitely not gonna mess with these guys. <laughs> yeah, we'll just get out of here, yeah. Call it a day. All I'm trying to do is just make progress in the game. These battles are like, no, you're going to fight all of us. Okay, I guess not. There we go.
a fortune sphere. All right, let's get the hecky heck out of here. Okay, these battles are seriously becoming annoying now. I mean, it's like every few seconds now, I'm getting into a battle. It's like, this is stupid. She awaits the arrival of the strongest. She is still alive? As much as Micah and Seymour. I see. Lost your nerve? No. Nothing frightens me now. Good. Good. Braska would be proud. Then I must not let him down. Good. Ah! Another battle! That's a big boy. It comes. Things ugly. Walk out, him out.
bring Val down to and do some handiwork here. Yeah. Alright, that works. Ooh. She but she's just shit. <laughs> Thanks, Val. Okay, you know I'll take you uh Put in Miss Lulu. <laughs> uh. Ooh. Cheese. Critical hit. Yep, a little bit of D spell. It's Titus. <laughs> yeah. He did a lot more attacks than he usually does. Hey, can't we rest a little? No need. We reach the summit soon. I know. That's why I want to stop for a bit. Soon means that there's not much time left. Yeah, unfortunately. Fine. I'll think on the way. Fine. Ooh, that's a lot of good stuff. Current sphere and a Hey, come on. Let's go. We are We're almost there, aren't we? Oh, yeah. We've come a long way. <laughs> What's so funny? You remind me of myself. Well, that's Before, good. The closer I came to Xanarkin, the more I wondered. When we arrive, Brasco will call the final Aeon. He will fight sin, then die. I thought my mind was made up long before. But when I stood here, my resolve wavered. Hmm. Never would have figured. Legendary guardians choke sometimes too, yeah? <laughs> Legend
legendary guardian. I was just a boy. A boy about your age, actually. I wanted to change the world, too. But I changed nothing. Braska paid the price. That is my story. God, he's so cool. Just that swagger walk. All right, let's. Go to Zenerkin. A city dead for a thousand years. A city I had to see with my own eyes. Ah, oh, poor guy. The end of Yuna's journey. Better think fast. <laughs> we ain't got much time left. The last chapter in my story. Eek. My thoughts, they kept floating up and then slipping through my fingers. Slipping away before I could pin them down with words. Yuna, I say no. If we go down there, then you'll... Riku. You're a true friend, and I thank you, but I must go down to Sanerkind. I'm not saying we shouldn't go, but should we think about it some more? There's got to be some kind of way we can save you, Yuna! All my life, I knew this moment would come. Yuni... Aww. Thank you, uh -oh. Riku. Thank you for everything. Don't say that, Yuni. It's not over yet. Tell Sid, thank you. Tell him yourself. Oh, please. Yuni, don't say that because we're gonna see each other again, okay? Kimari. Man, that's like straight denial. Does it sound like the ocean? You put it up to your ear like a seashell? Sir Oren, Kimari told me when my father wanted me taken from Bavel to Besaid, it was you who told Kimari, right? I had always wanted to meet you someday. I am truly glad that I had that chance. Having you as a guardian was so great an honor. I don't know how to thank you. Perhaps if I defeat Sin, that will be my thanks to you. That's what I'll do. Yes. I will challenge Sin. I will defeat Sin. If you are all there watching this, then I guess Sin is already gone. And so am I. I suppose. <laughs> anyway. I just wanted to say, Sir Oren, I thank you. Kimari, <laughs> do you remember the first day we met? I was only seven. My father had defeated Sin, and all Bavel was celebrating. Everyone was saying what a hero my father was. I was so happy. But when night came, it occurred to me 
My father had defeated Sin, and now he was dead. Now I was all alone. I couldn't sleep. So I wandered into the town, away from the celebrating crowds. I stood on the bridge in Bevel, where my father and I had parted. Standing there, alone, I could see the fields where he had fought Sin. Then, you appeared, Kamari. You said you were looking for the daughter of Vraska, remember? At first, <laughs> I was so scared. Until I realized what a gentle person you are. <laughs> you weren't used to talking to children. When I told you that I was Braska's daughter, you said you would take me as far from Bevel as you could. That it was the wish of a man facing death. I think I cried then. Because that... That was when I knew my father was dead. And I would never see him again. You just held me. Without saying a word. Aww. I cried after we got to Besaid, too. When you tried to go, after leaving me in the care of the temple, I held on to you crying, Don't go! Don't go! And you listened, Kimari. You stayed. Kimari, thank you. Thank you so much. And I've always liked your broken horn. Waka, Lulu. I'll never forget my days spent with you, growing up in Besaid. We always played together, us and Chapu. That's why I was always so happy, I think. And when you refused to let me become a summoner, and I did it anyway, I'm sorry. I've always wanted to apologize. You know, when you tried to stop me then, really, I was happy. I could tell you really cared about me. You were like my big brother and sister. No, I think you really were my big brother and sister. What else? <laughs> I love watching you play Blitzball, Waka. <laughs> I even love it when you scold me, Lulu. <laughs> really. I guess that leaves the newest guardian. Star player of the Xanarkand Apes. You are... This is what it feels like. It's a much more wonderful feeling than anything I had ever imagined. Wonderful. But it hurts sometimes. Oh, poor girl. Mm -hmm. I wonder. I... <laughs> I just want to say thank you for everything. <laughs> Maybe... Maybe that's why it hurts. When I... When I think about us never being together again at all... I'm afraid. No, I shouldn't say that. I'll do that part over. <laughs> What you up to? Yeah. I forgot how sad that part was. Okay, so that was Yuna's last will and testament. Let's head on down to Zenerkin. Sorry for the longer episode, y'all. Even though I'm chopping out a lot of this. I at least wanted to get to Zenerkin in this episode. 
I mean, just look at this. I mean, just look at that. City dead for a thousand years. Now, we'll say this for a thousand year old city, it looks pretty good. I mean, it looks well intact for the most part. Minus some glitchy stuff. And here we are. We have come full circle. Now we're literally at the beginning of the game. You know, it looks so pretty. She just has that look like, I know you're trying. I know you're thinking. Listen to my story. This may be our last chance. There was more, right? I mean, like that time. Uh, anyone? <laughs> no time for stalling. Yes. I think that we should stop. Maybe. For now. <laughs> Crap. Here we go. Well, now we're caught up in live time. No! I don't want to! I know it's down there, it's mean and scary! Okay guys, in the next episode we will tackle Xenarkin. Alright guys, I'll see y'all then.